Hi everybody, this is Anthony from xanthonyjohnson.com and in today's video I want to show you guys how you can start driving traffic leads and sales to your business using Facebook groups and Jarvis which is formerly known as Conversion AI which is a AI writing assistant that can help you write better copy for your business. So let's get started and let's jump into it. Now this can work for any industry that you can think of really. Uh, as long as they got a Facebook group uh, and they're answering questions inside of that group and you can ask them, you can get traffic, guys. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to a group to show you guys how to do this. So I'm just going to go over to the uh, group section, click on that. And then what you want to do is you want to go over here to the side here where it says search groups and click that. And whatever industry that you're in. Make sure that you choose a group that is relevant uh, to your industry so you can answer questions uh, that people are asking inside of those groups. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to uh, Black YouTube. So I'm going to click on this here and we're going to search for that group. OK, once that group has po popped up, uh, you just click on the group. Then what you want to do is you want to click on this search option here. So I'm going to tap that and I'm going to start looking for questions that I can answer inside of these groups so I can draw uh, targeted traffic to my uh, blog or YouTube channel or whatever you want to drive that traffic to. So what you want to do is you want to type in keywords like uh, questions that uh, that people have uh uh, posted inside of the group so let's do one real quick let me see if someone has asked any questions like promoting their social media like YouTube channel on social media sites so let's do something like uh, what is the best social media sites to promote your YouTube channel. Okay, hit search. Let's see if anybody has been looking for that. Okay, so we got one guy here, and this is yesterday. So this is very important. Also, what you want to know when you are searching for questions is that you want to go for the questions that have recently been posted because the ones that have been posted maybe. Uh, you know, a couple of years ago or something like that, uh, that person probably has got an answer to it and they probably, you know, uh, might not want to look at more answers and stuff like that. So what you want to do is uh, make sure that there are recently been questions that have been posted inside of the group so that you can be the first one to answer those questions. And what you want to do, so if you want to do that, you want to look over here to the filters and then you got these filters here that can help you find uh, certain questions that have been just posted or local uh, questions for local businesses and stuff like that if you're in a local area. And so when you go over here, you just post that you've seen, you can check that. Uh, you've got most recent posts. So this would be very good if you want to get the most recent post and you got a post by uh, let's click on this by you or your friends. So if you got friends inside of the group and they've been asking questions, you can answer the questions for them. Then you got tag location. Now this is for local, more like for local businesses that uh, are looking to answer some questions from potential customers that they know they can answer, provide services for. Then this would be very good for a local business. Then you got the uh, post by date. Uh, let's see here. Now, this what I was just mentioning about is that you want the most recent questions. Now, if you can't find some, maybe you can go back a few years or something like that and check it out. And some people might be still interested into uh, the questions that they post. But you really want to go for the most recent questions that have been uh, posted inside of that group. So you want to stay maybe in um, 2021. So that's the time I'm shooting this video. Uh, that you want to stay into and answer those questions 
so that you can be like the first one to answer those questions and draw that traffic to your sites okay let's jump back to this so okay here's a question here where he's asking what are the two most effective social sites to promote your youtube channel right okay so you can kind of um reword this a little bit when you go into jarvis and try to uh answer this question so let me jump into jarvis here and let's see if we can answer this question for him so what i'm doing is i'm going to jump over to jarvis now I'm inside of jarvis and you have a lot of templates that you can use in here but for this video what we do is we're just going to focus on social media so i'm just going to click on social media here and we're going to go down to core answers now this is really uh designed for like core answers but you can also use this for a uh, facebook group questions i mean they're just the same you know it has the same thing you're just answering questions here so let's uh, jump on this right here and let's click here core answers okay now we're inside of core answers so what you want to do here is you want to type in a question that is similar or you can just copy and paste the same question inside of here so what I'm going to do is I'm going to type something in similar to what he was looking for so I'm just going to go to uh, what is the best social media sites to promote your YouTube channel Let me see, let me screen it out a little bit. Okay, now in this next one where it says information to include in your answers. So if you have knowledge on this topic, right, what you want to do is you want to put in, so let's say if you have knowledge on this, uh, oh, the best social media sites to promote a YouTube channel, and you'd be like, okay, is it Facebook? groups or you want to do a uh, quora that's what you want to put inside of here that gives java more information uh specific information to pull back so that you can get uh content on that so that's what kind of information you want to uh put inside of there for the information to include in your answer so what i'm gonna do is i'm just going to do let's say let's say facebook groups all right now the next one here is the tone of voice so you got a uh, tone of voices if you click on this button it'll show you a couple of them or what you want to do but i'll just leave it as it is for right now all right so once you've done that then what you want to do is you want to come down to the bottom and you want to click on generate ai content so let's just click this here And what Jarvis is going to do is going to bring me back some answers to this question here. Okay, Jarvis is done. So this is the information that it has pulled back. And this is this will save you so much time that you don't have to really um, research a lot of that. And just you can just go over to Jarvis and type in that question and get answers back quickly. So let's look at it. Let's look at it. Let's check out this first one here. So it says, answer is Facebook is a good place where to search for more groups that might share your interests. Most people seem to use YouTube for making and sharing videos. So it's also worth checking out the video sharing category on Facebook. So uh, let's sort of, let's check out the other one. Okay, Facebook groups are one of the best ways to promote your YouTube channel because they are highly active. Join the most engaging Facebook groups and start uh, posting content that other members in the Facebook group would find interesting. Okay, I kind of like this one here a little bit more, better. You know, so what I can do is I can grab some of this content uh, and then you can start also as your favorite or you can just go over here and hit the uh, copy button 
And once you copy that, you may want to reword it a little bit and stuff and put it in your own uh, words or add or subtract a little bit to it. And then what you can do is you can just post that over here to the question here and answer that question. And when you do that, um, you can also like leave a link back towards like if you want more information, something like that. Uh, leave information back uh, to your blog or your website or your YouTube channel. So you just kind of answer it a little bit. And then if they want more information, you can direct them to your YouTube channel. If you did a YouTube video on this and that's how you can get targeted traffic back to your websites and and uh, also get leads so if you have a, a landing page squeeze page or anything like that and the person uh, finds this information valuable well they can leave an email address and um, and then you got a lead and then you can just nurture that lead follow up with more information and turn to a sale so that's how you can get targeted leads uh, traffic and sales inside of your business by answering Facebook group uh, questions guys if you like this information make sure you drop a comment um, uh, below also I have a link to Jarvis if you want to try this out and you want to um, uh, you know have Jarvis write content for you there's a link going to be in the description below and you're also going to get 10k uh, more credits that you can use so for right now I'm on the uh, uh, starter plan or something like that so I got like 20k credits that's how you use Jarvis guys to answer questions I hope you like this video and I'll see you in the next one guys thanks for watching bye bye